Ladies and gentlemen, hobos and tramps, cross-sided mosquitoes and bow-legged ants, welcome to the sacred ground. Thank you everybody for our Thursday night open mic. I'm excited about tonight because this is one of my buddies and uh, god damn he plays well. I think if I had never met him before and I just listened, I'd want to be his friend. <laughs> He's just that good. So we're going to have Charles Haymarket out here in just a moment. So first of all, welcome to the Sacred Grounds. Our uh, hosts for this evening are the people that own this place, and they also own Panhandle Pizza next door. So if you want more than they have on the menu here, please go over there and order something, and Teddy will deliver it through the back or bring it in for you. So if you want pizzas or hamburgers or ice cream and stuff like that, they have all that over there. Just go order it from Teddy and he'll bring them. They'll be open until nine o'clock and then they close there and then we'll stay here until 10, okay? The other thing is, uh, this is an open mic that's been going on since 1973. Probably the longest running continuous open mic in the city besides the poetry people who've been doing it since 1972. So they started a year before us, and I thought, we can't let them get away with that. <laughs> so they, Wednesday nights is poetry. Please come on a Wednesday night, sit in, and listen, if anything else. Also, this is all going out live over the internet on Ustream. Ustream. You can find us on Ustream. Just look for Sacred Grounds Cafe. If you have some kind of mobile device, you can actually watch the show 30 seconds behind by going to that URL up there. Ustream, ustream.am, that's 10, A-E-Z must be in capital letters. A-E-Z must be in capital letters. This damn website is upper lowercase sensitive. So if you don't put a capital A-E-Z, you wonder why it doesn't show up, okay? So you can call your friends, just before you get up, about 10 minutes before you get up, and say, get on your goddamn computer and go over there and watch me, okay? This will be posted to the site later. Because we are streaming this, we ask the audience to just shut the fuck up, okay? Please do not talk during the performances. If you come here to eat something and talk to your friend, please go outside. That's why we have the tables out there. You go out there, you can chit-chat all night long. We won't hear a damn thing you have to say unless you get too close to the door, okay? And we can always close the door. So we ask for that consideration. This is about the people that are up here presenting something. I actually call this a workshop, not an open mic. It is a workshop. It is my school's workshop. I am Mr. Natural, for those of you who seen the cartoon. I've been around, actually I've been standing here for about 42 years now. So every Thursday night you see me right here, and uh, I'm right here in the neighborhood, sort of an icon from the early 60s, and I'm still here, still trucking. Okay. Still trucking. Okay. So what we'll do is the first half an hour uh, plus will be our feature, Charles Haymarket. And then after that I'll come back up to the mic reintroduce, grab the sign-up sheet, and then start bringing you up, okay? I do not follow the sign-up sheet. Don't come and look over my shoulder constantly wondering when you're up, because it annoys the piss out of me and I'll put you at the end. Just, okay, what I do is I try to get new people who've never been here before, I interlace them with the regulars that are here. So you never know when you're gonna come up, okay? I will come up to you personally tap you on the shoulder while the other person is playing and say, you're next. That's not the time to go get a sandwich down the block, okay? People do that. I'll say, okay, you're next, and then they leave. I don't understand that. So please, when I come to you and say, you're next, that's the time to get ready. Do not come up on stage and tune up. Go outside and tune up for that 10 minutes that eight minutes you have before you come up. Come up, do your thing, and get off. Every minute that you waste adds up to the end of the night, and that's three or four performers who can't get on. 
So please just come up here, do your thing, and get off stage, and sit and enjoy and listen to other people and participate. If they ask you to sing along, sing along. If they don't, don't. Okay? Be kind. Rewind. All right? When I come back up, I'll tell you we have three basic rules. I'll give them to you later. But now I am very anxious. I'm five minutes behind, and I am anxious to bring up here one of my buddies. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Charles Haymarket. Hi, how are you? Hey, hey. Yeah. hey, hey. Hi, Jennifer. Everybody watching at home. Tonight's special occasion, I decide to upscale myself by calling myself Charles Hayes Valley. <laughs> <laughs> Oops, I should have tuned out. <laughs> yeah, you know, I've always wanted to play guitar, and I've always wanted to play it reasonably well. Y'all know the story of Robert Johnson That went down to the crossroads and sold his soul So he could be the best guitar player in the world for a couple of short years Well that seems a bit harsh So I worked out a little vacation two week timeshare with old Snatch And I hope he wants his deposit back and I get to play just a little bit without losing my soul but now instead of Robert Johnson's hellhounds on my trail, I got big ass road raging pickup trucks. Out on the highway, real late at night. Only me and that old devil road rager awake. Rub me off at your crossroads, just another pussy truck. Flip me off.
JFK's assassination and one of the biggest coups on the U.S. Remember. remember that old enough to remember that? Yeah. Raise your left hand, keep your right hand up. Raise your left hand if you're old enough to remember September 11th and the next coup on the U.S. and the 2008 banking crisis. Look at us all, we're being robbed. We're being robbed. We're being robbed here. I no longer believe in Santa Claus, the Easter Bunny, or the Tooth Fairy. Hallelujah. And I no longer believe the government's cover story on what happened on September 11th. Bullshit, forcing it out the barrel of a gun. So if we 
win. I said word. Post drama, stress syndrome. Lock down and blaze by TV's drum. Post drama, stress syndrome. Wait for the next few days, morning to come. Wait for the next few days, morning to come. Sit 
that was worth it. tuning was and buy a guitar and put it in this tuning and that's where all the other songs came Yeah. 
my wallet, everyone I love, still I don't call them. I care deeply, I care. Not as much as you probably care to buy my CD, now that we're on the subject. <laughs> buy my CD, tell me that you love me and my songs. The beers and the blowjobs are great, thank you also, but you know, the CD helps.
Let's hear it one more time for Sean yeah. Haymarket, everybody. Thank you. We bring these features every week, and uh, we are running out of features. So uh, we have um, this next month uh, in November, we're not going to be here for Thanksgiving on the 27th. And so then we got December, and I'm not sure exactly what day we're not going to be here for Christmas, but Christmas is like the 25th, so it'll be... It's on a Thursday. They're both Thursday. Christmas they're both Thursday. Thursday? They're both Thursdays. Yeah, so we won't be here on Christmas. Christmas. I might be here. I have a better time here than I do at my house, believe me. So anyway, so just to announce that. So uh, the rest of the everything else is open. We have Bill Wadwell who will be coming on the 15th of January. So that's the only thing we have booked then. And next week we have Dr. Dream. So I'd like to introduce that. So now let's say one more time and ask Charles to play just one more number from, from us. So ladies and gentlemen, please encore. so far this year. Ooh, lovely. Very promising. Very promising. Not quite hot yet, but saving the ammo. It's already on. The memo has been written. The memo has been written and sealed. All right. I wrote all these songs and I hope you like them and this one's also on the CD that you're probably going to end up buying after the show. Yeah. Sorry, little Jimmy Page came out right
ignoring the millions of souls that we kill. What comes ragingly popular and on no doubts allowed? charges your firstborn. <laughs> okay, folks, this is where the open mic starts. What I will do is I will go through the list, uh, pick you out one at a time. Uh, I will come up to you before, while there's somebody else up here performing, and I'll come up to you and say you're next. That's the time to go to the bathroom and tune up and then come back out here, go outside and tune up and come back. Be ready. Don't come up on stage, tune up, you know, call on the telephone your girlfriend and tell her to get online and stuff like that. We don't waste time up here, okay? Uh, again, next week we have Dr. Dream, and you will get to hear Dr. Dream a little bit later on. to start out tonight by playing a standard. These are jazz standards. They are for public performance, uh, regardless of what you stream or any of the other idiots out there say. If you buy the standard real book, they come from a book called The Real Book. If you buy The Real Book and open up the front cover, it says on the front cover, these are for public distribution. They can be played by anyone, anywhere, and do not worry about the copyrights. So naturally, YouTube doesn't read the book, doesn't care about it, and every time I play one of these things, they always try to put a strike against our website, and uh, you know, and then I've got to, uh, I'm, uh, I'm guilty until I prove my innocence, unlike here in America. It's more like British justice or uh, Russian justice. And uh, I have to prove my innocence to a bunch of uh, computer programs. Because I found out that there are no human beings that listen to any of this stuff except you people when you're at home watching. What's happening is there is a program called Shazam, and this program is listening when you're uploading, and it can listen at very high speeds, and it's the one that decides whether you're infringing on the copyright or not. And the problem is, is that they haven't really taught the machine what the copyright is or is not. So I'm going to play here a song that normally You'll hear from a guy named Nat King. A guy named Nat King Cole, one of my favorite people. This is called "When I Fall in Love" by uh, uh, Victor Young and Edward Heyman. Not Haymarket, but Heyman. Thank you. 
10 minutes. 10 minutes is punitive. It's not a gift. It's something I can take away. If we get busy, I will take it away and change it to 8 minutes or something like that. So please bear with me. I Don't worry about where you are on the schedule. I do not follow it. I sort of follow it, but what I do is I know that all you new people who come here for the first time always wind up coming in last. So we always have all the regulars and then a list of the last. So what I do is I'll take the first new person on the list and bump them forward. And I will interlace you new people with the regulars, every other person. So get ready, okay? The other thing is I need to know who y'all are so I can put a face on it so I can come up to you. So uh, Sans Tribe, Sans Tribe is you guys, okay? Tom, okay, a soul. S-O-L, Souls. Oh, he He's sitting right there, though. Okay, the guy sitting there. Okay, gotcha. And, um, huh. Can he, is, I think it's, I don't know, Joan? Jonas? It's John Farley. Joan. Uh, yeah, John Farley. He hasn't shown up. Oh, he hasn't shown up, so we don't have to worry about it. Okay, and I think I know everybody else except maybe Step. Changed his name now from Step and Champ. Okay, so first one up right after me, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the stage, little Maria. All right, Maria. Woo, woo, woo. There are picks here. There is capo, capros here, and capo, and there is a tuner if you need it. You can take it outside and tune up.
Maria, ladies and gentlemen. And now we would like to welcome to the stage, and you know, we don't uh, call ourselves the, uh, the uh, sacred grounds for nothing. This is a time to sacrifice a virgin. So we'd like to bring to the stage, please, Tom. Thank you. Um, I'll stand at that. Probably holding it up. Tom is clear. You got ten minutes or two songs. Hello. Hello. Where are you from? I am from New Zealand. Christchurch, New Zealand, as a matter of fact. And it's wonderful to be here in San Francisco. A beautiful week now. Everybody, please shut the fuck up! You the Thank man. you. <laughs> the first rule is shut up. It's about the performer. Take that rule. Don't hurt. 
Thank you. All the way from New Zealand as opposed to Old Zealand? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> it's kind of weird because New Zealand is old and Old Zealand is new and uh, Greenland has got snow and Iceland has grass. Yeah. What happens when the world's upside down and you're looking at it this way. <laughs> So now I'd like to welcome one of our regulars, ladies and gentlemen. Please welcome to the stage, Rainbow. Woo! Unfortunately, this is a true song for a lot of really great people. So well, here comes John Law. Standing on the edge of the 
Now, before I bring them up the stage, 
probably my fault there's all this chaos going on so let me make myself absolutely clear audience you can all leave people who are performing please stay that has I made myself clear okay now if you want to be an audience participant then you're here to listen to the artist which means your mouth is closed closed unlike any other open mic I do not let the audience carry on conversations while people up here bleeding their whatever for you okay please listen to the artist now if you have to whisper something to somebody that's fine but if you're going to go on for more than 15 seconds please take it outside which is why we have the chairs sit out there have all the damn conversation you want and when you're ready to listen to the artist come back but if you're going to be in this room and not listen I will get in your face okay please understand that I want you all to be adults just like you've gone to the San Francisco Symphony or the ballet appreciate and love the artists who are up here bleeding for you it's also being filmed and going out on the internet live so we don't want your conversation here while you're ruining the performers okay performance the second rule I have besides shut the fuck up is don't play along with people okay just don't play along with them unless they ask you to okay a lot of people come up here and said please sing along then do it hundred percent but if they don't go back to the basic default of having manners and listen to people and support them with your ears and my third rule is if you hear something you do not like or don't understand applaud anyway okay it's about giving people a feeling of comfort up here we have gotten more beginners started here than any other open mic in town and that's why because beginners people who are afraid to perform will come here and open up for you people if you show them respect now I don't expect you to remember all these rules so I will remind you with a big shish every now and then it ain't personal unless you want it to be and I'm not the kind of guy you want as an enemy I'm the greatest friend in the world but I'm also the meanest person you've ever met so please have some manners for each other and show each other some respect so now we got some new people here and we want to give them a big sacred grounds welcome so please welcome to our stage Sans Tribe <laughs> New Zealand as well. Woohoo! Well, welcome New Zealand. Oh, thanks, right? Looks like you got a couple of rooms. I mean, big round of applause for coming all the way to New Zealand. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right. Oh, <laughs> 
Yeah, this is the camera. Hey, man, I got a test. Uh, 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 yeah, I was going to say. Sure, thank you, Ray. Okay, now I'd like to welcome to the stage a singer songwriter I've known for a long time. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome Johnny Hernandez. Please take it outside if you're not listening to the artist. Really, really big on that. Oh my, oh my. Okay. Johnny Hernandez, ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Johnny. So, I actually wrote a, a, a serious one today. You know, many times they're not as serious. This is a more serious one. Uh, it was inspired by, I actually, I, I was reading uh, something online about Helen Keller. And um, they had, um, she had, she had conveyed to people who had asked her about you know, how she got through her struggles and all. And she made this statement that I thought was so profound that it could be turned into a song. What she said was, well, you can always turn your face toward the sun and feel the warmth. And you know, she couldn't speak, she couldn't hear, but it, it, I just thought that was just really good. Wow. So that's where this came from, yeah. Always turn your face towards the sun, though you cannot see the way and have nowhere to run. Hold your head up high, the warmth is there for everyone. You can always turn your face towards the sun, towards the sun. Life spent in darkness is more sure than ordeal. Unfair, unbearable, unrelenting, surreal. And yet there's the ability to reach out, to touch, to feel. An opportunity to know yourself, to grow, to thrive, to heal. And you can always turn your face towards the sun. Though you cannot see the way and have nowhere to run, hold your head up high, the warmth is there for everyone. You can always turn your face towards the sun, towards the sun. There's a sing along, this is it. You can always turn your face towards the sun. You can always turn your face towards the sun. You can always turn your face towards the sun. You can always turn your face towards the sun. Towards the sun. An empty one for sure. Despite the trials you face, it's your soul that remains pure. Embracing this truth unlocks the strength to endure. No matter time nor place, your boundless spirit is the cure. And you can always turn your face towards the sun, though you cannot see. And have nowhere to run. Hold your head up high, the warmth is there for everyone. You can always turn your face towards the sun, towards the sun. With no need to close your eyes, life goes on an endless dream. Images seem devoid of sight, sounds perceived without hearing. Yet somehow you find your voice and share your hopes with everyone. 
Yes, you can always turn your face towards the sun. You can always turn your face towards the sun. Though you cannot see the way and have nowhere to run. Hold your head up high, the warmth is there for everyone. You can always turn your face towards the sun. Towards the sun. Let's take it out, here we go. You can always turn your face towards the sun. You can always turn your face towards the sun. You can always turn your face towards the sun. You can always turn your face towards the sun. Towards the sun. Okay, so uh, this is like dedicated to all them TV creatures out there and all them other uh, hooligans. <laughs> There's a sing along in this too. You know, you'll pick it up quick enough. <coughs> hallelujah, hallelujah. My preaching to you has nothing to do with saving your soul. Hallelujah, here to fool ya. It's a giving of your mind, power, money, free will, and control. Hey, brothers and sisters, have I got a sermon for you? I'm spreading the word, if you haven't already heard, about all the good, good your blind beliefs will do for me. I'm er, I mean for you. Let's just sing. Hallelujah, hallelujah. My preaching to you has nothing to do with saving your soul. Hallelujah, here to fool you into giving up your mind, power, money, free will, and control. Here's the sing along. Hallelujah. Sisters, have I got a 
sermon for you. Thank you. Johnny Hernandez, everybody. Johnny Hernandez. And now, all the way from Canada, I have offered these people a small mini feature, which we've never done before. Unfortunately, we're running out of time, so what I'm going to do is give them 15 minutes, okay? And if they can get three or four songs out of that time, I'll let you know. We'll go for three, and if we got time, I'll let you know. But, ladies and gentlemen, we have not seen these guys for quite a while, and I'd like you to really put your hands together for twin. Thanks a lot to you guys for coming to Sister National. So uh, I'll talk quick. We're just, this is uh, the tail end of our uh, second, yeah, it's the second annual Sacramento River Music Harmonic Canoe Tour from Reading to, to the Bay paddling the bike canoe. Wow. So uh, yeah, that's the second last time we were here. That's what we were working on too. So uh, last year, uh, Knight's Landing, uh, Stingray's Marina, we started writing this song. It's, it's called Walkabout, or the Sacramento River song. It's the first song on our new album, North America, yeah, so we'll get going right here.
So we just okay. prior to the Sacramento River, we did the Mississippi River. This is the Mississippi River song of the Great Flood. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Let's 
thinking the young man, thinking the white man. Dropless picks, you're welcome to get some, please. They are complimentary. Thank you very much. Take at least one. So, twin, all the way from Canada, ladies and gentlemen, or what I like to refer to as North North America. <laughs> the North North continent. Okay, now here's what's up, folks. We are we have people come in at the last minute, and especially a lot of new people showed up here at the last minute. So we are actually out of time, and what I'm gonna do is try to make it work. So I'm just going to get all the new people to come up one right after another, and you new people can play your two songs. 
and then whatever time's left, we'll bring up the regulars and probably just one song from the regulars, okay? And that ought to make us, uh, you know, take us all the way to 10 o'clock. Uh, we try not to go too after 10 o'clock. So I'd like to bring up next Soul or Saul? Soul. Soul. So please welcome to the stage, ladies and gentlemen, Soul. Happen to have like someone play a back and check, which is this and that. You can say if, if it's copyrighted material, no, I'm mean, fine like, with me, but they will cut you off. It's a mobile speaker. Nobody happens to have like a eighth to eighth inch on them, do they? No? Nah? Oh. Uh. I mean, I could just acapella it if I have to. I mean, unless somebody knows like a little like uh, Spanish style, like four chord, they can come rock on the guitar. Oh, stop. Yeah. Yeah? Okay. Let's try it. Yeah, cool. Make it happen. Spontaneous stuff is the best, dude. Really good. Yeah. just to like go focus. shakes the ground. The room is quiet. The rain outside, the only sound. A dumpling and a rifle sitting ready by the door. He calls his sons. There's something I have to tell you now. His youngest looks so bad and wide-eyed, he doesn't understand why his father is being sent off to a foreign land. He opens his mouth to explain, but the pain takes the thoughts from his tongue. Mm. was never as good with his words as the shot of a gun. A soldier's fate to do and die and speak no more. Silent tears run down his white cheek to meet the floor. And his own is a coldness that he's never seen before. Unknown if ever again he'll get to see his three young boys. So he takes out three Bibles, hands each of them one. Gives his oldest the key to the safe which holds his gun. And right before he leaves, summons all the breath in his lungs. If I should meet my death, remember these words, my sons. Walk like a king, keep your friends close. Kill on me if you must. Listen to your dreams, make money, but never sell your soul. Women, they come and go, this life it comes and goes. Walk like a king, pray to the Lord every day that he may have mercy on your soul. Never a slave, 
you better die before. Keep your honor and I'll meet you in the sky. So now he wipes the desert sand off the pictures of his family. The song of God and call to prayer and through the air is blaring. His homie creeps through rubble streets as he checks his ammo. Once abiding people grow defiant, get more daring. With every misplaced mortar, every now gone uncle, every fatherless orphan, every childless mother. And as he hears her cries, he looks again, he doubts his eyes, his mind paints the faces of his sons where corpses lie. Collects himself and shakes it off, not one to lose focus. But too late, the mistake was made, now fire's broken open. Right then, an explosive blows a hole through their patrol. It's all the strength they have to limp into a building and hold them. They hold them off, the fire dies, but now the number's growing. On the road, we're calling for support, but no support is coming. This might be it, he thinks, so grab some paper, wipes the blood. The words he spoke, they must remember, so he writes his sons. Walk like a king, keep your friends close, kill only if you must. Listen to your dream, make money, but never sell your soul. Women, they come and go, this life, it comes and goes. Walk like a king, pray to the Lord every day that he may have mercy on your soul. Never a slave, you better die before. Keep your honor and I'll meet you in the sky. The back's against the walls and the sun quickly dropping low. The shots resume their flow, ricochet and start to grow. They radio and call some more, but still the response is no. The boss has spoke, the line is closed, it's clear they're on their own. The talk begins to surrender, so he steps in with a blow. I'd rather go home in a body bag than end up headless on a video. If I'm going out, I'm shooting. We ain't going down, we moving. There's only one way out this goddamn city, so let's get fucking to it. They charge out, start blasting. Every man he sees, he caps him. But right there in the action, a kid with a rifle that's pointed at him. He sees his son's face, they both blank and hesitate. A shot rings out in the distance, his chest it penetrates. As he falls down to the floor, he sees the rescue team in step. Behind him, the shape of oil drills in silhouette. And as a light begins to leave his body, he closes his eyes. Speaks one last time, the sun meets you in the sky. Walk like a king, keep your friends close, kill only if you must. Listen to your dreams, make money, but never sell your soul. Women, they come and go, this life, it comes and goes. Walk like a king, pray to the Lord, every day that he may have mercy on your soul. Never a slave, you better die before. Keep your honor and I'll meet you in the sky. Thank you. Woo! Uh, you I know it's kind of rough because the, uh, like, yeah, I know this was kind of rough because, you know, the, the back of track didn't work. What's, what's your up? name, man? Beatbox. <laughs> I appreciate it, man. Sorry, uh, what's your name, homie? So EQ, S O L E Q, it's like, it's right here. It's my thing, whatever. But, uh, New Zealand cats, I see you guys are like, you guys are young and, and uh, you know, mobile. If you guys are trying to fuck with some local hip hop, I'm opening for Cost uh, next Thursday at Brick and Mortar if you're going to be in town. So come fuck with it or whoever, you know, yeah. whoever wants to come. Um, that's all I got for you guys today, but I appreciate you. Uh, thank you, Mr. Nat. Thank you, sir. Yeah. So, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Be careful of the uh, broken glass. Um, I am famous for my barefootedness. See? Voila. My bare feet find everything, so if you just all leave it, I'll find every piece of glass. <laughs> okay, now we'd like to bring up somebody we've never seen, another newbie, so let's welcome to the stage John, ladies and gentlemen.
let it go. When the well is run dry. When the well, 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 well. When the well is run dry. Mm. See your own shadow. See your own shadow. When the world is run dry, you leave a cell phone in. Put your hands together for John. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, now we'd like to bring to the to the stage Sean, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, this next song I wrote uh, 
about a week ago and he's out trying to write about something very general like people in the world and stuff. Mm -hmm. um,